This is Brother Oswald speaking, and here we are in Guatemala City, Guatemala, in the province of Influcion. This is the Jimmy Swagger, Lucio Cristiano Fuente Garcia, Assemblies of God. What you're looking at here is the school. For the children in this community of Elucian is the name of this community here. They have different grades. Grado is the word, Spanish word for grade. Maybe you can see on these frames here the second and third grade classrooms here at the school. See that? See, it's a zoom in. That's the kindergarten right there. Preparatory Paul Lillies. I'm learning to pronounce some of these Spanish words, so y'all forgive me for my lack of Spanish pronunciation as well as my English. This what you see right here is Nehemiah's wall of Guatemala. This is the giant wall that has been dug out. As you can see, it is What you see here are Nehemiah's workers who are manning the walls. They're laying out the concrete blocks to build the walls. And here's, here's my brother Jack Temple. He claims to be number one old block layer. He's real shy too. Y'all see him hiding behind those blocks. And here are some of the other brothers from Advanced Temple. There's Donnie. This is some of the local help we've got. Ken, you see how big, busy he is a bee. Always working hard. There's another one of our wall workers. And on the far wall, far wall over there, is Brother Lonnie. If you can get a picture, it's, it's been dug out. And the church is being built onto the children's school here. I don't know who this guy is in the pink hat and the white polka dots. He looks like he's having fun. Well, y'all can figure out who that is. Where's old Chuck at? The Pepsi folks heard we were in town. We done bought all the cocoa they had here and they brought out a truckload for the thirsty hombres from Los Estados Unidos. Here again is some of the local workers. This is the local Jail, jailbird pile. These are the blocks that go on to the, the waiting hall that we're at here in Guatemala City, City, Guatemala. Back up top are where some of the men are working on putting together some of the iron support beams that have to go into this wall that's going to be 25 foot high. Our Jewish brethren would be envious of our wall that we have here, I do believe. Here we are in front of the, the school, the Jimmy Swagger school here. This is the tienda. This is where the store. There are some of the local children. All see, he sees he's being filmed on the camera. These are the children that Jesus Christ said suffered to come unto me, the little children. For such of these is the kingdom of God. And Jesus Christ is in this place. You can see the beauty of his handiwork, not only around us in the glorious creation, but in these people's lives. And they are as busy as ants. The book of Psalms for Jesus Christ said, Consider the end. And as you look around, you can see these ants that are busy for the kingdom of God to build up his church that his will and his love may be expressed in Guatemala. As Jesus Christ told us to go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. This is what we are about here in Guatemala. There's Senor Lani. 
Working hard. Nehemiah would have loved to have had him with him as he rebuilt the church in Jerusalem for Jesus Christ. As I was saying, Nehemiah would be proud of this man. And so was Jesus Christ. For Jesus Christ said, Even the Son of Man came not to be served, but to serve and give his wife a ransom, a ransom for me. We are all to become servants for Jesus Christ. We have to lay down our desire to be in control and let the Lord Jesus Christ be in control. But as there must be chiefs, there must be also be the workers. And there are many here in this place, as you can see. Men are working here on this church. I cannot help but to look around me. I marvel at the many contrasts there are. The little children, the poverty that's all around us, as you can see in these slides. The contrast between yesterday and today. I think of the scriptures. Jesus Christ says, I am the same. Yesterday, today, and forever. at his glorious handiwork and realized even as we work the Father God worked in six days he created heaven and earth yes but on the seventh day the scriptures say he rested and even as he rested so what shall we will rest but how can we rest when there are so many around us who are in so much turmoil and strife We must work while we yet can work, Jesus Christ said. The day cometh when no man shall work. We cannot forget his word. We must take his gospel. There is a goal in the gospel. And Jesus Christ said, wherever thou goest, lo, I am with you always. There's a goal, but there's a low. And we find that wherever we go, that he's already been there. And he sends his not anywhere that he has not scouted and prepared the way for us. I hope as you look at these pictures that you will be inspired not only look at these pictures but to go yourselves and make disciples of all nations. And remember that Jesus said, No, I am with you always. Even. We got quite a bit done since this morning, folks. It's four o'clock in the afternoon. We're getting ready to have some sort of a parade. Getting ready for their decoration day, like our Fourth of July. It's September the 15th. September the fifteenth. Well, it looks like a cross right there. That steel and that makes it appear like there's a cross right there. How about that? There you go. They blocks all up from the foundation up that high all the way around. Did you catch him doing the play? No, not yet. What do you do? Oh, well, hallelujah. Look at that. We need to get a stars and stripes up there. Yeah. Tying the flag up on the steel there. I get Lonnie there observing. Uh-oh, he actually picked up a trial. Ernesto. Will and DR there. Oh, we get work on the altar area. Fishing up over there. Can't lay more above that height right here because we need a lentil box filled with concrete. Get away from it. Rick standing there. Another cantina that's right across the street. Get cold drinks. Uh, local help 
locked. Boy, that's a backbreaker. Helps us. That's some sort of a ceremony. We're getting ready to have. Guys, got the torches there. The flag. Run the school. Exactly what they're doing, but I guess like the Fourth of July. Darn. Yeah, police. It's police, man. Police. It's police. Police. It's police. I guess they have a float on that or something. The there we go. That we don't know where or what they're going. They're having a parade or something for something.
Hi. <laughs> Very shy. Very pretty little girl. Handsome people. Dress nice. Coming down. I'll meet you downstairs for dinner. Hallelujah. Glory a Dios. I, I figured out this morning why Tom won't meet with the willing Amen. to be Amen. Well, so we're done uh -uh. with this day's so work. Built that whole wall down through there. Walk over here a little bit. Why do you think I didn't want this up any higher? Hey, I just about changed my So, then all that down to there, the net wall. Give you a bird's eye view. Oh, 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 that's done oh, good. We have a lot of help from the local people. We're all the way up to the top there. 25 feet. Well, that's how close we are to the store, to the 7-Eleven. Well, what, what are we doing? Do what? Get a good shot of the work area? Yeah, sure did. Monday or Saturday's work. Yeah, good, good. Grace of God. Day number one. Sign it off. Tomorrow we're going to on a on a, an excursion with uh, to some Mayan ruins, I believe. Okay.